Hello dear friends, Shiksha Mantra once again welcome you to the realm of learning and knowledge in the form of Shiksha. Yes dear friends, today we have taken a very serious topic. If you don't know this, obviously you are going to find life miserable. But with a little knowledge of what I'm sharing now, you'd make your life a very easy one. So how to do this? That would be our topic for discussion today. So what's the topic? The topic is VARV. Yes, dear friends, VARV. So let's see what's waiting for us there in it because uh, what's so special to discuss about verbs? If we are accepting such a simple subject, such a simple topic for discussion, obviously I have kept something very much essential for you to follow. So stay tuned, stay glued to this video till the end and explore everything what has been explained. Let's begin. So the first thing that I'd like to discuss here is what is verb? If I ask you the definition of verb, what you'd say? You'd only go after describing some characteristics of the verb. So what are those characteristics? You'd say a verb is an action word, it's an action word. So it relates an action. You'd say sometimes it speaks of state as well. Sometimes it speaks of position etc 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 and if i ask you what are the different types of verbs what you'd start you'd start with transitive intransitive then you'll say uh, no there are also other verbs like finite verb non-finite verbs then uh, you'd say that uh, verbs oh they have so many different kinds so how to figure out the definition of verb it's really something very intriguing. This question is a very delicate question if you are asked what is a verb. So here it's better to follow another factor. And today we are going to discuss that other factor that would make your life healthy and happy with verbs. Yes, dear friends, the first thing that you must consider of verbs, there are only 24. If you capture those 24 verbs, you'd get everything in it. How it is? Yes, dear friends, only consider finite and non-finite verbs. That's the trick. When you consider finite and non-finite verbs only, you'd get a list, a list of 24 verbs you'd gather them together and every plight for you regarding verb would be over. How it is? Let me put it into a table. But before trying this, it's better to tell you that you would better follow my telegram channel. You'll find the link in the description box below. And in that telegram channel, which very vehemently suggests the same name and the same logo used in this channel only with English grammar, Shiksha Mantra, Telegram channel with the same logo. There you'd find the table, there you'd find that list and everything. Whatever I put here into my YouTube channel, you'd find the supporting documents in my Telegram channel. To so subscribe that channel to get everything documented in it. And also, there's another thing that I would uh, share with you that in that telegram channel i have started a new segment that we fondly call what one minute english grammar yes dear friends only in one minute we teach english grammar there and by following that one minute english grammar you can brush up your grammar learning and your grammar skill very easily so visit that channel subscribe that channel and stay tuned to this video to get the detail of finite and non-finite and the concept behind it. So let's begin our next discussion of finite and non-finite verb here 
exclusive in this video only so dear friends here we have to make things simple simple in terms of what in terms of finite and non-finite verbs yes dear friends when we say finite verbs here what you'll get you'll get infinitives and it covers both full infinitives and bare infinitives if you haven't learned properly about infinitives you'd find them there in the i button above check the video and you'd learn all about infinitives full infinitives and bare infinitives and also with the infinitives you'd get what you'd get bare infinitives full infinitives and participles yes dear friends for participles you'd get both present participle and past participle so these are the list of non-finite verbs for auxiliary verbs and also for auxiliary verbs you'd get finite verbs and for finite verbs what you'd get you'd get present form and past form so this is the structure about verbs particularly this is the structure about auxiliary verbs so let me show you how it works for finite verb when we use it at infinitive you may use be or to be and when it comes to participle we are still in non-finite what you do you'd make it yes what tell me for present participle you would say being and for past participle you would say been so being and been these two terms would be used these two forms would be used for non-finite verbs or non-finite verb form of be then let's uh, shift to our finite verbs and here in finite verbs when you are in present form present tense verb form what you do you'd use am is are and for past form you'd use what you'd use was where and also here you must remember that this list of finite verbs where you'd find modal auxiliaries as well and some of these modal auxiliaries you'd find both present form and past form like shall should will would etc but for the others you won't find any past form you'd find only present form for them so let's check out which are the verbs where auxiliaries would provide only present form and no past form so there's the list must ought need dear must ought need dear for these four you won't get what you won't get any past form and this used and for used you would get only past form and there you won't get any present forms so this is the most important or key factors regarding verbs if you remember these structures you can deal with verb easily very efficiently so that's it from today follow our channel shiksha mantra both on youtube and also on telegram there's also a facebook channel for live programs for the bengali language and uh, also you can like this channel you can subscribe this channel with all notifications on and we are here to provide you many such very important grammar topic very soon over this channel only and wait for it till then bye bye